Today is a celebration for Green Bay's African American community. For the first time ever, the city put on a Juneteenth parade and festival. NBC 26's Valerie Juarez shows us how special it was for the community. A historic day in downtown Green Bay as dozens came out to celebrate hope, unity, and freedom. Step by step, they marched and sang in commemoration of freedom. As today officially marks Juneteenth, a day that recognizes the ending of slavery in the United States. I'm proud as the county executive to actually proclaim Juneteenth Day, similar to what the city of Green Bay is going to be. For Green Bay's African American community and its allies, this day is even extra special, as just this Thursday, President Joe Biden signed the Juneteenth National Independence Day Act into law. Sharon Harper with the African American Community Parent Network was the main organizer of this event. After her efforts to get an event started last year were shut down due to COVID, she says she couldn't be more happier to finally have this one come together. It means a lot. It shows that this city of Green Bay actually cares about black people enough to give us, they got the flag hanging at the courthouse, you know, black and white, Republican, Democrat. And for one local pastor who many call an icon in the area, African-American community. He says over the last 26 years he's lived in Green Bay, a lot has changed. I used to say all the time that when I first came here, it was 0, 0. 0.1 black person here, people here, but now we move it on up. And for others who attended the celebration, many were just blown away by how much the community came together. Just so special and I feel so blessed. Ain't no stopping us now. We on the move. We got it. We got the truth. And while the organizers of the event say the work isn't over yet, they say they're very thankful for all the support the community has given them this far. In Green Bay, Valerie Juarez, NBC 26. Looks like a great celebration. Thanks, Valerie.